Hello guys, welcome to today's video tutorial by Trust Only at TS Tech Talk. So guys, if you are new to this channel, please um go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Look at the button below, click on that red button below, and then if the button is already um turned gray color, just ignore that because you are already subscribed. And if you haven't just subscribe and click on the bell icon to turn on the notification so that you can see more of my video whenever I upload them. So guys, um on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to upload multiple videos on your Facebook page. And on my previous video, I showed you guys how to upload different videos, the same video on different um, pages. But on this one, I'm going to show you how to upload many videos, like several videos, so many videos on your Facebook page. So let me show you guys how to upload the videos. Let's get started. So go ahead and type in facebook.com slash creator studio. My network is not on. All right, let's refresh. Wait for it. Now, um, once it's loaded up, go ahead and click on create post. And you can notice here where it says upload multiple videos. Go ahead and click on that so that it allows you to select multiple videos to upload. Okay, once it displays this particular option, go ahead and click on video upload. Now you can notice the last video I uploaded was, was this. How to delete your Facebook series. So I'm going to go ahead and start working from this area to this particular section to comparing. So I'm going to upload this video. You know what, guys? Um, instead of instead of selecting one after the other because they are all on different folders, I'm just going to go ahead and drag them into that stage. So uh, we'll click on the document section, Camtasia. And then I'm going to start dragging them one after the other. So drag this to the section where it leaves copy. Leave it be. Select the page. Um, this is going to be very difficult because they are all on different folder. So I'm going to cancel all this upload and then start it all over because it's actually going to be showing only one video to be uploaded. But I don't want to upload only one video. I want to upload all of the whole videos. So this is actually a mistake. And I'm going to go ahead and cancel it. And I'm going to say, OK, I want to discharge. So let me go ahead and click this section. And you know what? I'm going to go ahead and copy all of them into one particular folder. And then I'm going to select each and every one of them and drag them into this particular folder so that it uploads at the same time. Let me go ahead and do that. So I'll first come here. This is the one I want to upload first. Cut it. So uh, we'll come to comparing and paste it. And then come right here. I uh, just cut the series, right? Series, 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 series. I'm done with this. I'm done with this. Then cut it right here comparing paste it Come right back I think once I cut the video the folder itself doesn't display on that particular section so I think I'm okay with these four videos so I'm going to upload this Comparing playlist and um, how to create a series, how to find Facebook series, and how to delete Facebook series. So I'm going to upload these four different videos to my page. So I'm going to select the page that I want to upload them to and click on it. And then I'm going to wait for it to load. So it's just going to load the name and then I'm going to add description, title, and then either I'll save it to draft or I'll upload it. But I'm going to try to schedule each and every one of them, whichever way I want them to be uploaded. I'm going to set them up. So let me allow them. They are all loaded up. 
and they are still uploading you can notice the upload is on zero percent so it's going to complete up to hundred percent so after selecting them all i need to do is to go ahead and type in the description the tags and then once i'm done i will click on this particular option and then choose a particular option which i want to use and I will prefer scheduling them because I, I wouldn't want to upload all of them at the same time. So I'm going to go ahead and schedule almost all of them. And then don't forget to I also change the thumbnail once you are at it. So first of all, let me go ahead and work on the description. So like before, I'm going to pause this video and work on each of the description and the tag. I already showed you guys how to work on this one. So in order not to make this video so long, I'm just going to pause it. Alright guys, so I've taken time to add a description and a title and it took a while for me to do that. So um, if you want to add titles, if you want to add the description and you want to change the title, all you need to do is to click on this particular section and you can notice the title displays. So you can change that to whatever you want. So once you finish typing, click on done and the same thing for the description click on the description and then start typing whatever description you want to type so if you finish typing just go ahead and click and press tab on your keyboard then click on click on done so once you're done with that click on the tag area to add tag and then i think there is a mistake i saw something here double click if you make any mistake and if it refuses to delete, just go ahead and delete it and type it again. So this is how to find. I'm just going to um, I'm just going to delete this because it's a mistake. So I'm going to type a series. So. Once you're done typing and if you've reached the maximum, you are going to notice where it says you have reached the maximum number of tags. So once you've seen this, just press tab on your keyboard or you just scroll down and then click on done. But guys, I want to give you guys a tips. If you are typing your um, tags, you know you are allowed to type the different words, right? But how about when you type the same word that is already existing? For instance, um, I'm going to delete this one and then type something like this is Facebook watch, right? And then if I'm going to type Facebook watch again, so remember after typing your tag, you hit enter, but now it's not allowing me to hit enter and it's not going to be away until something different changes. The reason is because we are typing the same word that is already existing. So if you are experiencing this, that means you already typed the word. So that's the way Facebook actually matches the word that is already existing so if the word is already existing you can't type them again all you need to do is just go ahead and type something different for instance if i say um if i change this one to capital letter it's a bit different now you can notice it's different from the previous one so i can still add this one and it displays so it actually increases my um seo but that's not what i want to do here i'm just going to say um, where to find where to find Facebook series or how to find Facebook series. So go ahead and delete the one you don't want. And if you don't type in, just hit enter. And then I want to change this back to capital letter. Sorry, <laughs> I want to change this to capital letter. So once you're done typing, just hit enter then click on done then the next thing i already uploaded thumbnails here because i don't want to waste time uploading them so let me show you guys how to upload the thumbnail so i'm going to upload this thumbnail because if you notice this one doesn't have a thumbnail others have i just uploaded them so just click on this um arrow icon right here it's just behind this section and it shows no file chosen click on that arrow and it's going to load up a file for you so wait for it to load so once it loads go ahead and select the location where you have your thumbnail located and make sure you design a catchy thumbnail that people will easily understand and know what they are looking for whenever they find your video so i have a catchy thumbnail i design and i'm okay with this so we'll just select that i've already selected it so if you guys notice this video has uploaded up to 100 percent if it's still uploading it's going to be showing this percentage of its upload so since i've completed the upload of this video i'm just going to go ahead and schedule the video since i don't know want to 
publish them right now. So if you want to publish them, just click on this icon and then click on publish now. But I do not want to publish them right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and schedule the video for upload later. So I'm going to click on this schedule icon and now select the date which you want to schedule the video to upload. I do not want them to upload the same date. I want them to upload next week, um, Friday. And then scroll down. I want to change the time. Um, I want it to be around zero six. So guys, notice if you're writing this zero six, that means it's AM. But if you want to write it to PM, make sure you use um make sure you um add the number up and for instance it can be zero six should be twenty one. I think it's 21 so you can go ahead and make sure you um, are actually accurate with whatever you are writing and calculate it so um, once you're done just go ahead and click on below or if you just click anywhere outside of the area it's going to schedule anyway so let me go ahead and schedule this one also and I'm going to scroll down a little click on schedule select the time and then I want this to upload on Sunday and I'm going to change this to 12 because it's going to upload um, no I'm going to change this to 21 then I'm going to click outside and you can notice it uploaded at that particular time for us and you can notice it's 9 p.m. so I'm going to go ahead and schedule this one also and then Using the date, I want it to. This is uploading on Sunday, right? I want this one to upload on Tuesday. I actually don't upload every day on my page, so, so you guys shouldn't be surprised. But if you guys want to get more of my video every day, just make sure you check out my Facebook page. But on my um on my Facebook page, I don't upload every day, but on my YouTube page, I make sure I upload every day. I don't try to miss a day on YouTube. So um, if you guys are interested in getting more of my video, make sure you are subscribed to my YouTube channel and you'll be in for all of my video. So, uh, if you guys are watching this video and you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure you're already subscribed. So if you're done uploading those videos and you want to um, save them up, go ahead and click on save up and they will be published to TS Tech Talk channel. So, the next time um, the video is ready to publish, it's going to publish. So if you guys are interested in this video and actually if it helped you guys, I would appreciate if you share this video with your friends on other social media um, network. And I would appreciate if you also subscribe and ask your friends to subscribe whenever they visit. And please smash the like button on the video. And if you have more questions about this video or any other particular course on Facebook Creator Studio or any other challenges that you are facing, please leave it on a comment below. I'm going to try my best to assist you the way I can. And if I can't do it, I'm going to let you know. And if you guys are actually appreciating my work, please subscribe, share my contents anywhere on the web and stay home and stay blessed. Peace.